everybody, welcome to Recipes for Life. I am Mercedes Wilson and I get lunch with Jess and Zach today. Hey! What's up? Woo -hoo. All right, so we're doing salad and salmon. You can't get any better than that. I love it. So Jess, you're gonna hook us up with a great salad. What do you call this and what's in it? Um, I guess this would just be my summer salad. I don't really have a name for it, but it's just spring mix, strawberries, blueberries, candied walnuts, and some mandarin oranges. Mm -mm -mm. And our friends from Niagara Produce hooked us up with all of this food you see here. Thank you, Niagara Produce. Come on, Jess, let's put it together. How are we doing this? It looks so good. So we got some spring mix lettuce here, right? Yes. The thing I love about this is how simple it is, but you're using such good fruit. Like, who doesn't love fruit? I actually really love it with the fruit. I'm more of a Caesar salad, like a real basic type of person, mm -hmm. but I think when you add the fruit and stuff like that, it just makes it even better. It's refreshing. Yeah, it's refreshing yeah. is the right word, right? Yeah. So you add in the strawberries. Oh, that looks good. That's so good. I love it, I love it. And then the candied walnuts. Oh. This is like, I think you need these. Yeah, can I just try one? Yes. Yeah, I can try one. so good. Mm. All right, Zach, so what do you have going on on this side? Uh, I got a little salmon, something that we do a lot. Um, and we're going to throw a little lemon pepper and a little cayenne on there just to spice it up a little bit. Okay. So it's what you like that you really Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And then what are you adding there? And so this right here, just a little cayenne pepper. Okay, a Which little I'll bit. add to mine so okay. that I have a little something. I have to say, I've never had cayenne or lemon pepper on my salmon before. Once so you, this is you gotta, you gotta, you know, you gotta mix it up. You never know what you can get when you mix it up and do stuff mm -hmm. out of your comfort zone. So that's good. So okay, Zach, what do you normally cook your salmon in? So usually I do a little butter, okay. which I'm gonna grab here from the fridge. Oh, wrong really? butter. Really? <laughs> really? Oh, look at that. They don't call Zach. How important is a healthy diet at this point in your life? Well, you know, for me being, you know, an athlete, um, eating healthy is like right up there with everything that I kind of had to do mm -hmm. on and off the field. Um, so for me, you know, I try to make sure I keep something, you know, clean so that way when I'm going on the field, I feel ready to attack. Um, and just, you know, everyday life, I think that's the biggest thing. Um, you just have to clean, eat healthy, eat clean, and, you know, kind of attack the world. Yeah, yeah. What about you, Jess? I mean, it's important, I guess, like, at this point, it's like a lifestyle for us. We yeah. have to eat healthy. Like, yeah. You don't have to, but just, it just makes us feel better. So. Yeah. I have to ask this question. What is one thing you would throw into life right now? What is one item, one ingredient that you need to have a healthy life? Good company. Good company. Good company. That's yeah. good. Good friends. Girl, you're preaching to the choir. <laughs> what about you? Uh, I would say peace. I think, you know, just with everything else going on around the world, um, just having peace, having good company, having people around you that love you and you love them equally. Yeah. I think that's a big thing. I tell you what, y'all keep cooking salmon in this berry salad. <laughs> I'll be good company and peace. <laughs> I tell you, you get a good piece of good company, whatever. Recipes for life. Thank you for joining us. Thank you, uh, Zach. Thank you, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for joining us. We'll see you next time. Oh my goodness, Mercedes. She has the best job in Western New York, if you ask me. Who knew that Zach Moss could cook? And let me tell you, healthy eating, that is right up my alley right now. I wanna go over to their house and they can cook for me. Just kidding, I'm not forcing myself over your house, Zach and Jess, but I do appreciate the way that you cook. And if you'd like to see Mercedes Wilson's recipes, you know where to go, mercedeswilson.com slash recipes. And of course you can follow her on Facebook too. She's always posting updates on everything that she's doing. She has a beautiful family, you should definitely check it out.